Hello everyone, in this video I am going to list a variation product on Amazon through flat file. Go to three lines, catalog and select the option add products via upload. Click on it. A new page will be open. You will see an option upload file here and there is another option down there download blank template. Click on it. A pop-up will appear. Click on the second option download product spreadsheet. A new pop-up will be appear. Spreadsheet language. By default it is selected. So move on to next. Select the product. Write it uh, your product name here and click on search. A multiple category related to your product will be appear down there. You can click on this option to see all the categories. Uh, one of uh, the category that Amazon automatically selected that mostly uh, sellers use for the product. So I will go with the same product uh, category that Amazon selected. That is stock pot and click on continue. Now again click on select option. So the category will be selected. Next, select the marketplace in which you want to list your product. I want to list my product in Amazon UK so I will uncheck all other marketplaces. There is a beta version of the template. For this product listing I am going to inactive this option. I am going to inactive this and this is the survey option skip this and just click on generate template a template will be downloaded open this uh, template you need ms excel to edit this uh, template to enable editing on this uh, ms excel click on enable editing and uh, in the first column write the product type uh, my product type is stock pot. I will select in first five cell stock pot as uh, one for parent SQ and four for child SQ. In seller SQ, I will write parent SQ first. SQ is basically the product identity you can uh, write the product identity in this call um, after writing the uh, parent sq write the child sq name i have four different colors for this stock board, so i will write four different sq name that identify different colors of stock board. In next column I will write the brand name for this product. After writing it you can simply drag it to other cell. Update or delete. Select the update option as we are going to list a new product. So in that case we will select update option here product id and product id type first select the product id type for uk marketplace uh, you have to select ean number for all the product type so i am going to select ean number for all the product type uh, after selecting the en then write the product id i have already uh, have product id if you don't have you can go simply go to the website barcode barcode talks and buy the barcode from this website that is very cheaper and you can use for amazon listing they have different uh, packages as you can see that cheaper and more cheaper 
you can buy and you can use them here next item name item name i have already written item name description and features in a separate sheet and simply copy the item name from the sheet and paste it here next column is manufacturer i will write the company name here next column is uh, recommended browse note you can simply drop down click on drop down and select the recommended browse note item price in my case it is 74.95 i will drag it to down and quantity for this item is 100 next option is variation most people make mistake in this section so keep an a good eye on this in parentage select parent first and for the rest of the sq select child in the next column parent sq write the same sq that we have earlier written in second column copy it and then paste it here paste it down you can simply drag it down also for the next column relationship type select the variation option for all the options select variation and in the next column variation select which type of variation you want to create in my case i am going with color and size you can select whatever you want to next option is we will move it to next option and that is color write the color name for your stock code as we have already written a uh, color name in sq so make sure same uh, sequence will be used here write the size name for your stock board i have a set of stock boards so i will write the size multiple size here select the material type there are multiple material types i will select the relevant uh, material type that is die cast aluminium our product is made of die cast aluminium so i will write it here die cast aluminium next write the key product features that i have already written in separate sheet as i already told you i will simply copy them from the sheet and paste it here five key product features added successfully now i will one by one drag it to rest of the sqs you can uh, follow whatever way you feel easy i am doing the way i feel easy after successfully adding key product features in all my four sqs next option is special features so i will add them here die cast body tempered glass lid next one is handle molded with the port induction base and the last one is ceramic simply drag them to the rest of the sqs after adding uh, to the rest of the sqs next option is dimensions so i will write here the dimensions 
for this product first I will select the dimension type it is in centimeters so I will select centimeter and drag it to all my SQs I will fill this uh, dimensions option and come back with other options so that video would not be so long I have added width depth and height for this product the next option is compliance I will select the country in which our product is made in my case it is Pakistan I will select Pakistan in rest of the SQs simply copy and paste or you can drag it to rest of the SQs in fulfillment you are seeing only one option in order to see rest of the option click this plus icon you will see all the fulfillment option now go to fulfillment center ID and select default option I have already copied the product description from the sheet separate sheet that I have created for this product I will copy it and paste it here and drag the same description for rest of the SQs now item condition is also not seen in the template so I will find it by pressing control and F key right here item condition and you will certainly go to that cell item condition right here new for all the SQs the next option is shipping method in shipping method select the template that you have created for your FBA model in seller center in my case it is migrated so I will select it to all my four SQs that's it our template is now completed all the information that we have we have on the sheet now click on save close this window now go back to your seller central from where you have downloaded this template as I have already told you the upload file button in the start click on this upload file button and upload the template that we have already saved on our system after fulfilling the product data as you can see that uh, the file don't have any error in the initial stage click on submit product Amazon will process our file and show you the status of your file as it is now done our file does not have any error Amazon system accept our flat file successfully now you can see the file product in inventory this is our product currently the product is uploading and it will take few hours to show clearly but most of the data is uploaded successfully now we will upload product images for all of our four SQs one by one in order to upload images click on three dots and manage images in images click on upload multiple files You can upload it by one by one or upload it in bulk 
I am going to upload it in bulk. Just select all images and there it is your products images. You can change their sequence by arrow key or you can also upload swatch product image here. So I am going to upload swatch image product image as well. That's it. Your product images all are also successfully uploaded. There is an error which we will remove and click on save and submit. Do this to all other three SQs. If you have same variations, I will not show you for the rest of the SQs because it will uh, longer the video. Uh, now I will show you the final uh, look of listing after a few hours. This is the listing that we have created. There might be some uh, data missing in first few hours but after 24 hours you will see all images and all data will be shown on the listing. This is how you can upload a product variation listing on Amazon through flat file without any error. If you still have any questions, do ask me in comments. I will help out you and sort out your issues. Signing off for today. Have a good day.